I don't know, maybe it's to deal with the fucking pointless hatch on top of the radiation pipe where they pump around their comical green suit. <laughs> Oh, the power station. This is. I'm really guessing. Good I'm here. guessing the noise in the background is meant to be a Geiger counter. Yes, that is but a like, Geiger counter going off. But like, we don't have a Geiger counter, do we? It's built into the suit. That's the explanation for it, by the way. And they they explained that in the hazard course, but you weren't paying attention. <laughs> Nice. Geiger counter is for counting Geigers, and if you say otherwise, you're banned. <laughs> Fucking don't show me up, you know. He was busy eating a scientist's ass, okay? How many buttholes are Affectionate name for them. Aw, oh, hot dog. You shot it! Don't... You don't get to go shoot it in the face and say, poor dog. Damn it, I'm all out of, I'm all out of rounds. Oh, that thing's awake, okay. It was actually asleep, but you woke it up. That's, that's actually something that those hound eyes do, they... Hound eyes have sleeping behaviors. <laughs> so so they'll naps. like go to sleep. Yeah. One lot of fly in here. Hello. Okay. <laughs> he just walked into the wall. Destroy the damned thing before it grows larger. Put my his mystery. He seems sad. What the fuck is this? No! 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 Get it off me! Get it off! Get it off! Whee! It's got telekinesis! So, the... There's a... This is a rocket test silo. I'm guessing I have to go and activate each individual part and then I can activate that. This... Creature is blind. It it moves based on sound. Now, if only the game gave you little balls of of a uh, of explosive material that could produce a lot of sound. How was how was he meant to know that? The well, the guard was trying to tell you, and you ran right past him. And also, it gave you grenades right before the uh, entrance. Yeah. So this is a uh, something. I'm not quite sure what it is, but it's very big and very mean. And it is growing through the bottom of the rocket silo. So this is the area to oxygen and fuel, which you need to turn on the flow off to launch the rocket. Or not launch it, but test Set fire. Set on fire, yeah. <laughs> That's a sewer, Gordon. Um, how do I open this up? With a shotgun. Untrue. <laughs> Uh, try using the crowbar on it. I'm pretty sure that grate is destructible. This game needs to be more clear on what's destructible and what's not. That, again, is something that was polished in Half-Life 2. Uh, they more standardized the idea of, you know, what is destructible versus what is indestructible. Like I said, it's just one of those things that older games had where, like, they just gave no shits about the users. Like, we know how to do it. You just gotta figure it out. Fuck you. Yeah, that's sort of why I'm here, so that you don't spend too much time, you know, fucking oh, yeah. around trying me, to find the way forward. It would have forward. taken me a while to figure out that that's what you went to do there, because like, it didn't look destructible to me. 
yeah, you know, and that's what that's why I'm here, so that you don't like you can actually enjoy the game instead of getting like yeah. weirdly frustrated uh, trying to figure out what's going on. Wee. This is what this is the uh, Black Mesa fucking gigantic fan room. Black Mesa big fan. Yeah, I don't know why we have the Black Mesa gigantic mm. fan room, but we do. What now? We fly. Am I meant to stay here, or am I meant to climb up before it starts spinning fast? You're probably meant to climb up, but you can get the, it doesn't reach the ladder. You can climb up now anyway, so. Oh. Are you sure? <laughs> it um, very much looks like it does reach the ladder. Hmm. If it did, then that was a very poor time to save. Okay, well, uh, just move fast, okay? Oh, you can turn it off. I didn't know you could actually turn it off. I assumed that the fact that it had two buttons would mean you could turn it off. So I'm guessing what I'm meant to do is turn it on and then go. Or don't turn it on. Turn it on and then go. Yeah, that was weird. You turned it on and turned it off and then turned it on again. It's like an Apple computer. <laughs> Yeah, so there's a bunch of shit at the top. I'm guessing I gotta throw a grenade in here and it goes wee. Fimzix. Wee. Wee. Done. That's pretty yep. cool. Now, can I jump in it? Yeah. Yay. Ow, that, that would definitely just slice you into pieces right there. It's, it's the Black Mesa comically gigantic fan room. We use it for comically gigantic fan things. Like blowing people around. Like blowing into people. Into a great of misery. What if we kissed in the Black Mesa comically <laughs> gigantic fan room? <laughs> Fuck off. Cockroach is going over to the body. They don't like my yeah. flashlight. Ooh. Smart roaches. Okay, that that one's like, real chill, that cockroach. I like the way they made them look like Doritos with legs. <laughs> yeah. That's another <laughs> advantage, I believe. I believe, um, because I, I explained the situation with, like, the low-poly models to Turtle. I think they changed the uh, cockroach shape for the high-poly model, which is unforgivable. They made it actually look like a cockroach. Which I gotta say, when they were making the cockroaches, they were like, Hey guys, guys, what shape's a cockroach? And someone's like, I don't know, fucking triangle three, I don't know. Have you seen those uh, accounts that are just dedicated to posting pictures of low-poly animals? No. Uh, I, I, it's like a trend. They'll post, like, like fauna that was meant to be in the background of a game and never, like, viewed close up. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. Birds flying in the distance. And they'll, they'll look hilarious, and I believe that all of those started with the cockroach. <laughs> nice. Oxygen on. Fuel on. Alrighty. So you've turned on the oxygen and fuel, but you still need power. Okay, no. So it's a matter of heading back to the rocket and taking the second path. Don't go, don't go down again. Wait, that's what, what I went for? Oh shit, yes it was, you're right. Yes, it, it was the sewer that you would have never have guessed. Okay, go back this way, follow the pipes back. And then I've got to follow the power pipe, yes. Yeah, so there's another area accessible th uh, through the tentacle room that holds the power. I, I like how I said holds the power, not generates the power. It holds the power. It keeps the power. I believe it's on the lower level. Oh, did you jump down two levels at a time? You might have to head up. Oh wait, no, it is down further. I was wrong. Fucking grow some balls, you stupid... Nancy boy. God. You, you, had, you have five health. Oh, I, I want to see I do. you 
I want to see you fall from that distance and survive. I didn't realize I only had five HP. <laughs> Basically, it's it's the equivalent of a man on the brink of death falling on one foot. Yeah, I mean, he's like an emaciated cancer patient falling down like three stairs. <laughs> Yeah, so this is the power area. Fuck's sake. Fucking stop hitting me, you stupid fuck. This is one of the um, more finicky puzzle areas of the game, but I, I I don't know. I like it. I think it's charming. Like, there's something about the uh, okay. Call me call me crazy. Okay, there's something about the tentacles. <laughs> don't fucking bite me. Don't bite me. You just blew him away, I western did. style. Great. You whipped out a shotgun and. Turned him into mulch. Shit. That's a real solid green goop right there. Shit. <laughs> yeah, so. Ideally, maybe don't blow up the passageway, and if you do blow it up, go on the one bit that isn't blown up. Good idea. You need some ammo. Y'all ready for this? We call that a glancing blow, which doesn't make any sense because it doesn't have eyes. It kind of does have an eye, like... Nothing turns into an eye when it blinks. Look. Oh no, I, I, I meant the shotgun. <laughs> uh. Uh, yeah. they're, they're called hound eyes for a reason. Those are actually big compound eyes. That gonna hurt That's me. Meant, it's meant to be water, just trust me. <laughs> hmm. In some universes, it is considered water. I love the frightened animation they do. Oh, you bitch! You dropped me from like two fucking feet and I died again. When's the last time you fell that far? Oh, thank God, there's help here. I left you alone while you eat. He's, he's chilling, I'll let him chill. I let him chill. He's just he's just chewing. He's just chewing on some bones, them bones. <laughs> he died to the elevator. How the fuck was I meant to know that was gonna happen? <laughs> You're meant to like see the elevator coming down from above, but you positioned yourself perfectly to be caught between the um uh the collision of the elevator and the walkway. I didn't even, honestly, I didn't realize that elevator was there. Yeah, yeah, that's fair. I mean, if you don't know it's there, you don't know it's going to descend <laughs> from above. Why, what is the... Like, there's a running motif of elevators just sucking. That bitch dead. So, remember how we talked about elevators uh, probably not being the best idea to yeah. take? Uh... This is one of the prime examples of why, isn't it? Didi. You did it. I'm guessing that's timed to the point where it only falls once you jump off it. Oh uh, no, it falls regardless. <laughs> oh, okay. Who would have thought you'd still be alive? I hope no one expects me to start up the generator. Smith yeah, I do. Down there and never came back. Start up, bitch. But Smithers went there and never came back. <laughs> I love the way they fall. 
Ui. Actually, but this... This was in a mystical time before ragdoll death animations. There he is at Smithers. <laughs> this is my hiding spot, and I'm not moving until the situation. Why are you crouched like that, you weirder? Go away. Do you think you like to crawl to me sexily? So you've activated one button. Is he gonna get blown to smithereens? His name is Smithers. Uh, I don't know what's gonna happen to me, honestly. I never stayed behind to check. What now? Well, you've turned on the generator. So that should be supplying power. Where do I go? Back the way you came in. This thing scares me though, why is it moving like that? Science. Can't you tell? Whee! Done it! Excellent. Someone has restored all power. We'll have the engine. Someone. No Someone! Cheeky bitch. You you risk life and limb to be called someone. You're tired shit, man. Another clone defeated. My <laughs> power grows, Gordon. Wagger. How'd you get in? Oh yeah. <laughs> you would I'm be like the worst. For the elevator like, to come down. <laughs> you would be the worst to take it anywhere, because you'd like you'd walk in the front door and then you'd be like where go? How do I leave? Will this ball kill me? It shouldn't do. You have enough health. Major fracture detected. Major fracture. It's fine. <laughs> so you turn on the power so that water is angry now. It's angry water. How about we fix that with a grenade? How is that meant to fix anything? I don't know. You need to get around it. There's a vent there. Um, vents? Is there a vent entrance, y'all? I think there is. Well, they're actually... No, there is. S I'm confused. Suicide is easier than making the jump again. In fact, I think making the jump again... I think there is a safe way to get down. I just cheated you out of 40 health. Yep. Where am I going? So, uh, remember crates? Ah, oh, fucking crates. You can, you can push one small crate to the big crate and then jump up on them and c crawl around on the uh, electrical wire. Also, remember the crouch jump. Yeah, that really isn't clear. <laughs> There's a few ways to get past it. If you have enough health, you can just tank the damage. Uh, you can push crates into it to stop it, or you can do that one, which is the most efficient way, in my opinion. You've done this every time you've I come back to this I keep forgetting. Well, that guy's green. <laughs> For fuck's sake. Why can't I make that jump? It's so easy. Remember, you can crouch jump to pull your legs up and make allow you to make longer jumps easier. So now, we've got to get back to the control room, now that power and fuel and oxygen have been restored. You stupid bitch. You... Turtle, I don't think you understand the concept of sound. You're meant to draw them away from your location. You're not meant to throw the grenades at your own feet. I'm heading for that ladder over there. Yeah. Oh shit, wrong way. That would have ended badly anyways. That was your own that was your own <laughs> face. Did you see your Wait, own I, face I fall off? Of? Fuck's sake. Yeah, I'm gonna say my face was just lying there. Is 
so this is number one you'll be able to uh get exact some revenge against this thing very soon You know, it's the authentic Half-Life experience. The tentacle monster gets everyone. It's not even a sexy tentacle monster, it's too pointy. These ladders. <laughs> I don't even know what These ladders <laughs> can fuck off. Yeah, um, the one thing that Valve has not mastered in their whole time of making games is ladders. Why do you think you never have to climb a ladder in Portal 2? Yeah. Because they realized, and they just gave up, that they don't know how ladders work. Home free. Now make that sucker into calamari. <laughs> Avoid the barnacle. Don't get sucked up by the barnacle. Oh. Away he goes! And with a simple flick of a switch, Mr. Clean gets rid of dirt and grime and grease in just a minute. Mr. Clean will clean your whole house and everything within it. I have been big destroyed. Nice one. You killed the tentacle beast. Where's Stein's bitch? Now, you have to proceed the only way out. Through the hole it came from. <laughs> Stupid. Oh, that'll fucking. never get old. Barnacle bitch. <laughs> that will never get old. Get out of my way. But yes. Now it's time. I, every time you fall like even a <laughs> tiny so distance, did. I yeah. prepare for the flat line. <laughs> what two HP? Yeah, you don't say, say emergency user dead. <laughs> uh, it's it was trying to say user death imminent, but it was cut off by the load screen. It just said user dead. <laughs> the HEV suit has different dialogue. That's its head. Magnum. Oops. Down this the thing magnum. Fucking awful. Uh, yeah, that's its head. <laughs> Noise. Now you're free to continue <gasps> your travels. Oh my lord! It's health! <laughs> I love how you that, have that exact reaction in every game you play. <laughs> Oh yeah, bitch. What's these little pizza boxes floating about? The Black Mesa Pizza Box Delivery Service happens on the River of Ooze. It's kind of like Willy Wonka in here, to be honest. Wanna catch it? Oh fuck! Nah, it's cool. Have I'm fun chill. catching it. I'm chill. I'm chill. All right, all right, all right. This shit ain't even toxic. What's this game all about? I'm fine. And you have gone into the area that secretly controls how they're able to uh, handle barrels eternally coming out of that pipe without needing to be. Uh, Did the game just like straight up lie spawned. to me that this was toxic? <laughs> like, I did like no it damage. Drain it was draining your suit power the whole time. But what? Ugh. God damn it, at least I got to go on a ride also, in the barrels. You're literally uh, in an environmental suit designed to uh, withstand dangerous and deadly environments. 
Wait, so where the fuck am I meant to be going? The, 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 the lower pipe, senior. Oh, I see, I see. But yeah, I, I, I've done that before, and I love... It's just very funny to me, the fact that the barrels just get put into a secret side tube <laughs> and get recycled through the level. That works too. There was a, a little thing you were meant to do there, but you completely circumvented it and it worked. Nice. Oh, fuck. Well, how the fuck am I meant to survive this? Uh, you're meant to be dumped out uh, onto health kits on a table. But yeah, you can also just avoid it like that. Ah, yes, the infamous... Shit. Yeah, just jump and try to hit the table. Oh, uh, hmm. This is one thing that I, uh, I remember being a bit fucky as well. You can tell what part of the uh, tubing is going to collapse. Yeah. Also, you have a flashlight, remember? Hmm. Didn't mean to do that. This ain't gonna be easy. Yeah, this is one of those areas that I had to do multiple times on one of my initial playthroughs. Like, it's one of those things that seems very unreliable. Yeah. <laughs> You're meant to hit the table and take no damage. But they kind of fucked it up a bit. I hit the table that time and still died. Yeah, maybe try circumventing it by going oh. around the edge. Yeah, because I think I, I had this happen to me and you can go around the edge of the pipe. There, there we go. <laughs> that is not what I meant to do there, but it worked. I kind of, like, slid down the edge really, really carefully. Yeah. Uh, that's one of the areas that I did worry might get you. Asa, I knew it. So, um... You have the Magnum now. The Magnum is very strong, but you won't be finding ammo for it as often as you will other guns. Hmm. So, use it wisely. Okay, look. Oh, my lord. Oh, my god. You have surpassed the final boss of half life. <laughs> the tube. Big boy. Yeah, that's, uh, that's, that's a big, big boy. boy. Big chungus. Am I meant to be able to kill this guy or is it a running away sort of thing? You can't kill this guy. You are meant to uh, avoid him. He has very these magical toasty fingers. <laughs> Ooh. You're really trying to use those grenades to be fullest, aren't you? I am. Excuse me. There was a thing here. Hey, old. You all right, Mister? You can get the power on. That train will take us straight to the surface. I would try it myself. It's a long way down the generator room, and there are things in the way. <sighs> no, you're not gonna die. You're not gonna bleed out. You're just gonna chill. He's lost hey, a lot of blood with that wall. <laughs> hey, let's see. What am I meant to be doing in here? Uh, you'll need to navigate back down to try and engage the track power to the train system for everyone's favorite chapter on a rail. Whereabouts am I going now then? I lost that. Oh, fuck me. So 
So that bigger old thing is called the Gargantua. It seems pretty gargantuan. Yeah, it's uh, it's like a big old fuck off big boy. Fortunately, he's uh, pretty ah, dumb fuck. and slow. Like, he was just stood there toasting the air where a marine was for a few seconds. He's not that clever. Speedrun. Speedrun tactics. Come on. I expect an accelerated Man, back these off fucking head here. Crabs. Can you, like... Fucking... Headcrabs, bitch. Yeah, headcrabs can be killed real quick with the crowbar, though. So anyway, I started blasting. Turn on this fucking thing. Oh. He's in this boy. You had done that. I don't know what he said. Oh, there's an air uh, suit power charger on the wall. Behind you. Got So, your job is to head down to the generator room and uh, get past the things in the way. The shotgun's so bad at killing head crabs. <laughs> so I will use a, a I fucking landmine. I didn't mine. need to use the landmine, I've got to admit. They can kill you just as easily as they will kill enemies. <laughs> Be careful. I just fucking planted it and not mean to do that. Oh my god. Uh, one moment. Let's go again. Gang. Let's carry on. Cool. Uh, which way was I going again? Oh, god, that way. Uh, the the, the way with... Yeah, they just blew themselves up. Don't worry. Oh, they did. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, there are explosive barrels in that room and they just fucking shot them. That's the doorway you just came from. I didn't realise that. Saw a thing and thought I'd twist it. Keep her going up, up, up. Hello. You'll have to deal with a threat greater than an alien incursion. The United States military. Ah, you've you've achieved what I know as berserker mode. <laughs> where you just don't give a shit anymore and you start beating stuff to death with the crowbar. What the hell are you doing up there, little fella? Oh my god. <laughs> When I said crowbars, uh, crowbar. I called them crowbars, really. <laughs> Remember when I said grenades have weird physics? Yeah. But the Magna is very good at dispatching marines, though. Seems it. <laughs> Seems it. Yeah. I know the weakness of the United States Marine Corps, and it is grenades. Not ah! Grenades. I can't name weapons. That was, a, li that was right. a live grenade on the floor, then. I thought he dropped oh, he it probably... when he died for me to pick it up. No, he just had a live grenade that he dropped when he died. He just he just threw it at you. Yeah, uh, it takes two magnum shots to kill them uh, if you hit them in the chest, one if you hit them in the head. Nice. Thank God. Yeah, so if you're just a god gamer and get headshots, you'll save a lot of ammo. Perish the thought, you know. Where did you come from? What are you doing? He's he's going on a hike, man. He's he's just you know he's having fun. He's just chilling. He's feeling funky fresh. Yeah, so the Marines were preoccupied with the head crabs. Do you ever see a head crab take anyone over? Um, it was a bit too much for them to, like, you see those scientists at the beginning of the game who are there to give you an idea of what's happening, but yeah. actively seeing it happening? No, you don't. These head crabs seem to be more, uh, 
murdery. Murdery. But uh, there's military maybe, maybe it's like uh, the male head crabs are them. the ones that overtake and the female ones are the ones that attack you or some shit. What am I doing? Pressing buttons and seeing what happens. There's no buttons. Oh. There you go. Dog. I oh, opened my mouth to say <laughs> that's a bad idea. Should have and, and then it happened. Lo also, you have, you have secondary ammo on this gun now. Uh, if you press right click, grenade. Yeah. Yeah, secondary ammo is harder to come by than primary ammo, so don't waste it, but for large groups of enemies, it's real sweet. Noise. And now, we will soon be able to switch nest. Uh, that's helpful in the wall, by the way. Good, good, good. I have to be your eyes. You, honestly, you do because I don't even re because of the texture quality. I just don't render, like register them as something I can activate. That's gonna kill me walking through there, isn't it? Uh, nope. You okay. have to time it. So that on? Yeah. It can't be activated because there's something wrong with the generator on that side. You'll need to go down further to investigate. Down further. Oh, okay. I didn't realize that was a thing. I see now. That's the way you came in. This. So that that staircase doesn't just end there. I see. Welcome now, to I the see. uh worst enemy in this game. Very small fish. Lynch. Those are actual entities. And they actually will come at you and deal damage. Have you ever tried, um, gun fishing guppies? <laughs> Doesn't seem too easy. Uh, my recommendation would be just get out. You don't have to kill them all. Hey. Alright, they just keep spawning, anyways. I think I'm good to go now, anyways, aren't I? Yep, you need to activate the generator and then you're good to go. Oh, wait, we go! Yeah, um, you're lucky that you managed to dodge that by accident, because I think that is an <laughs> insta kill. Or at least it does like 50 damage, which would have going now? Back, up, Back up. up. You've turned on the power for the rail systems. So now you can take a train to the surface. Meat. I decided the grenade launcher would be slightly more effective in that situation. Can you imagine, like, <laughs> you're just on an assignment to, you know, commit some war crimes, and it's you just see a, a guy dressed in... jumping everywhere, yeah. Dressed in orange, jumping at you. <laughs> like a psychotic <laughs> jackrabbit. Fuck just bouncing off the walls. That would be terrifying. Yeah. The sheer intimidation factor of a man who only jumps. Really Elf on the wall. Yeah, oh, there's only one, <laughs> one little bit of health left. Oh well. Is this where I'm meant to be going? Uh, yeah, that's the way you came in. You came in at the bottom level, and you climbed up. I, I'm okay with being your brain as well as your eyes. Yeah. Dude, the the valve. You. Oh yeah. You went out of your way to close the door behind <laughs> you. <laughs> I've been polite. You're trying not to let the, the draft in. I keep hearing the crunch of me stepping on cockroaches. Are you kidding me? <laughs> <laughs>
He looks so proud of himself. It's hard to be mad. Like, look, him. Dad, I got a kill, finally! Look, Pa! I did it! Yeah, um... I'm not sure what grenades are gonna do for you in this circumstance. This. Yeet. I believe grenades inherit your velocity, so... Yeah, you gotta be like moving running, backwards right? when you th moving backwards when you throw them. Okay, that was weird. That was I weird. like I like grabbed it as I moved into a loading zone and it like reset my uh my progress. Yeah, animation. Yeah, yeah. You but you still threw the grenade. Fuck me. It's using magic. Yeah, I'd recommend I'd recommend uh not trying to deal with this enemy solely via grenades. Where's the Bullets. head crab? There it is. When you're dealing with alien threats beyond your comprehending, bullets are your best friend. The big boy. Now what? Uh, to the right of you there's a button. I think? Oh no, wait. Oh, uh, sorry, I was mistaking. Uh, yeah, the, the tracks are powered now. Wait, are they? No, it still says track power off. What the hell? Did I do something wrong? Come all the way back. I don't remember. Oh god. Brain. No work. Brain. Damaged. I don't know what the hell I'm meant to be doing right now. Well, fortunately you have Track dealt with the enemies in the area. So it'll just be a matter of walking. That guy's just gone for a stroll. I must have go all the way back and check. Don't worry. Like, most of the time that felt like you were spending a lot of time was just fighting stuff, so... Yeah. It'll be a simple, simple stroll. Another one health? Another one health. <laughs> oh, no, that was the same one health. Yeah, it was, yeah. Yeah. This is something that happens to everyone at least once in a playthrough. They'll, like do something and they could have sworn they did it right but it will be something they missed and they wouldn't have ever guessed it and I can't even guess it. It's brain they are both on. Yeah and you did do the right thing with the generator on the leech level you shouldn't have to do any more than that. Try, try going down into the generator room and pressing the buttons when you uh also, try not to die of full damage again. I'm trying not to, but this is difficult. That that would be really embarrassing if you did that again. Yeah. I'd have to stop being your friend and everything. Nope. Look at the things on top. Unit power 2, and above the terminal. Power generator is on, so you did the right thing there. Hmm. Maybe it was just the fucking label bugging out. Goddamn. I don't know what... It's worth it to go and see. It's not gonna kill you. You know, you're getting your cardio in. If I ran as much as Gordon, I, I wouldn't be <laughs> as fat. So you notice how those uh, those things have uh, collision on them? Those little... Oh. <laughs> Why isn't there a button on the fucking elevator? Gordon, you fucking nonce. Hey, Gordon Freeman is a respected member of the uh, scientific community. Black Mesa just has yet to design an elevator that works in less than five to six business days. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Try going back and just seeing, because it's possible it was just the label not working for some reason. Sometimes shit breaks in an old game, it's pretty much to be expected. Yeah. I did just save, luckily. <laughs> I did not mean to f Oh, fuck's sake. <laughs> See, it wasn't funny the first time, but when you did the exact same thing a second time, it, it became pretty funny. Yeah, so... You, you, the second time you've almost stood on. Hmm. 
Yeah, just try, uh... Maybe there's a button on the, uh, panel. I don't remember this area of the game as well. Nope. There seems to be anything here. Or try going down to the train and see if it works. What did it say? Uh, saying power. main power's not on. Oh, fuck, I forgot, yeah. Uh, the other end of the tunnel, there's a kind of a major sequence that I forgot about that is necessary. Down here. Not that way, no, the other way. The other main tunnel. Also, the rails are electrified, so don't stand on them. Yeah, I kind of forgot a major story sequence that has to take place with the gargantua to turn on the power. Oh, I'm so fucked up. <laughs> okay. What am I doing now? Uh, there's a tunnel that you have to run down past the Gargantua and it'll chase you. Yeah, you've turned on the generator but you still have to turn on, like, the fucking... I'm gonna be honest, I don't know what they're for. The giant Black Mesa, uh, pointless Tesla coil array. <laughs> nice. Alright, save here. I'll go down that way, right? Don't really know how I'm meant to be able to do this. Uh, try and bait him. Hi. Hi. And now run for your fucking life. I completely forgot about this whole area. You didn't hit the, the lever. You missed the lever collision. Mm. Yeah, I don't know what you did that caused him- I don't- I don't know what you're doing that's causing him to just path into that random area, but it's working. Try so go and try and press the power button there. Yeah. Yeah, you just- you weren't close enough last time because Gordon doesn't have three meter long arms. But, you know, that should be a thing in the HEV suit. Uh, gigantic arms. It's definitely for dealing with hazardous materials and not just because it's cool. Got him. If that killed you, I would have laughed Gordon so hard. Gordon has the most feeble legs known to man. Seat medical attention. Shut up. <laughs> Don't talk to the HEV suit that way. It's a friend. Fucking grow some balls, you stupid asshole. You, you, the save was before you, uh, <laughs> rotated the track. <laughs> I love how the majority of your deaths have been to fall damage. It's because I feel like I'm constantly at like 10 HP. Yeah, um, you can be left behind by your train. Uh, so this next chapter is heavily train based, so... Be careful not to let it get away from you. Yeah. There's a warning I'm going to give you now. Ready. Save game properly. Big save. Nice. Yeah, and then the train is just going <laughs> to... Yeah. <laughs> like it was nothing. I'm still at a, low, a lowly 4 HP. Need the help. Freeman, I've been waiting for you. One of your scientist pals said to give you a message. You're supposed to take this old rail system up to some kind of satellite delivery rocket. I don't know where it is exactly, and the old guy was so worried about getting out of here alive, he didn't tell me. 
Main thing is, the military aborted the launch. So when you do find the rocket, you'll have to get up to the control room and launch it yourself. He said something about a Lambda team needing the satellite in orbit if they were ever going to clean up this mess. Okay. Let's go. Let's go. Mario. Let's go. So on a rail is everyone's... I the think fuck just happened? happened. There were barnacles above oh, you, and I think fuck. one of them... I think... <laughs> you don't have to wait for the guy to finish his monologue, by the way. You can just grab the health and pull the lever and go. But I think I one honestly, of them tried to I didn't, grab you. I didn't realize there were barnacles. I thought these were, like, struts, like, holding this platform in place. Yeah, I think one of them grabbed you and it, like, pulled you into the geometry somehow. Quite literally geometry, because everything here is a polygon. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck it, hell. My god. Oh. Right, are we at a good stopping point? Because I was thinking this would be a good place to stop. Or should we carry on yeah, a little sure. bit longer? Yeah, we can stop whenever. It's a game where you can save and load wherever you are. I, just, I didn't want to stop in the middle of action sort of thing. I have, yeah, I have thoroughly enjoyed this so far. It's been very, very Good fun. Point, stop. Well, but yeah, we'll end, end the session. For those of you that are watching this as it comes out, I'll, I might upload this as one whole video. This might be split into two or three, depending. I'll see. Um, but we'll we'll make sure we play the full game before uploading this, so you guys aren't gonna like have to wait weeks between uploads because of man and never yeah, schedule. Yeah, probably a good idea. Either way, hope you guys did enjoy this. It was very fun. I've enjoyed it so far, and I'm actually excited to finish this game off and go on to Half Life. Two. I'm guessing it'll probably be like two more sessions about of about this length before we finish this game. Yeah, roundabouts that, I'd say. Cool. Anyways, yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye bye.